Good evening, I'm Elaine Quijano. The first hours of winter could usher in another government shutdown. The White House and Congress have until the end of Friday, the winter solstice, to agree on a spending bill. If not, the government will essentially run out of money, and thousands of federal employees will have to work without pay or face temporary layoffs just days before Christmas. At the center of this showdown is funding for a U.S.-Mexico border wall. President Trump wants a lot more than Democratic leaders want to give. Their tense meeting last week set the stage for a frosty face-off this week in Washington. Here's Errol Barnett. We're going to do whatever is necessary to build the border wall to stop this ongoing crisis of illegal immigration. President Trump's senior advisor Stephen Miller told Face the Nation a government shutdown is possible unless there's $5 billion of funding for a border wall. If it comes to it, absolutely. This is a very fundamental issue. He is not going to get the wall in any form. But the Democrat Senate Minority Leader Chuck Schumer refuses to budge. He's urging the president to accept his party's offer of $1.6 billion for border security instead. All he's going to get with his temper tantrum is a shutdown. He will not get a wall. The president's irritation today is aimed at multiple federal investigations implicating him and his associates calling his former lawyer Michael Cohen a rat for cooperating with federal prosecutors in New York and sending his current personal lawyer Rudy Giuliani out on TV to discredit him. The man is pathetic. He lies to fit the situation he's in. Cohen has been sentenced to three years in prison for paying hush money during the campaign to two women who alleged they had affairs with Mr. Trump. Cohen says Trump directed him to do it. Giuliani says it doesn't matter. Paying a $130,000 to Stormy whatever and paying $150,000 to the other one is not a crime. Giuliani also says President Trump will not answer more questions by the special counsel, in addition to the written answers that have already been submitted. Is the special counsel, does I mean, he want to ridiculous. interview the president? Yeah, good luck. Good luck. After what they did to Flynn, the way they trapped him into perjury, and no sentence for him. But so when you say good luck, you're saying no joke. way, no interview. They're a joke over my dead body. Now, Rudy Giuliani could not explain why President Trump's former national security adviser, Michael Flynn, pleaded guilty to lying to the FBI about his contacts with the Russian ambassador during the transition. Now, Flynn is to be sentenced on Tuesday, but Robert Mueller's team has suggested little to no jail time for him because of his ongoing cooperation. Elaine? All right, Errol, thank you.